Really fucking appropriate we're doing some big mouth tonight, considering the little shit we have to deal with here. So our puppy, well, not puppy, three-year-old dog's in heat, and we have to deal with Andrew over there. Andrew, come here. That's not his name, but... See what I mean? I know, you're a good boy. She's been faxed, so she doesn't really... She gets annoyed at this shit by now. Good girl. Are a good girl. Anyways, back to the show. Lay down. So, I... I'm not going back into the video log to see where I was. I'm just going to assume I was approximately at, like, the Bridgerton stuff. It makes me want to ride my horse shirtless through the mist. <laughs> Ooh, you flatter me, Duke Major Hug. Uh, have you come to ask me to dance palm to palm? Alas, I cannot dance with you. I'm joining the priesthood in but a fortnight, and it would be improper. Oh, of course. Oh, fuck. What is it? I wonder who the voice actor is. Uh, hi. Hi. You want to watch Big Mouth? It's going to be a little inappropriate for you. You too little. Just drop my Oh, no, please allow me, my lady. Lest our fingers touch sensually. Oh, yes. Oh, caress my bare hand in an untoward way. Indeed. So bare and so untoward. Oh, shit. Ooh. This is hot. Quick, let's go home and rub one out. Missy, are you okay? Because you closed your eyes and did a pretty elaborate dance. Yeah, I, uh, I gotta go. <laughs> So, Jess, before you go, I got you a little something. Really? It's an apple brooch! Ah! Wow. <laughs> Thank you, Mom. This is so expensive. Please, don't worry about the... How are you getting the money to pay for this? I mean, it's not like you were doing terribly in New York, but actually I didn't know anything about her, what she was doing over there, so... Who knows? Maybe she hooked up with a very affluent lover... I don't know. Maybe she sued Canardina. Price, which was $800, not including tax. I just wanted to show you how much I love you. I don't know, Connie. Am I really an apple brooch kind of girl? Oh, Jesse. Brilliant, Jesse. Of course you are. You're so hip. You're God damn it, Jeff. <laughs> Why not? You've played God and Happy. Why wouldn't you play the goddamn fucking brooch? Modern, and look at you. You're on Netflix. You're streaming in 27 languages. Oh, oh my God. Jesse, I have seen... Oh, that's Brazilian. Look at me. I'm all smart. And I'm still alone. My soul in the brooch. Yeah. And it is rich as fuck. Wow, Mom, thank you. You're you're like the coolest. Some might even say cooler than Caitlyn. <laughs> right? <laughs> Is everyone, like, obsessed with me? Yes, of course they are. I mean, how could they not be? Like the brooch, Jesse. Ooh, now we know. Jesse's rich. I'm looking at her boobs, and I'm so... Thank you for that input, Mom. Only getting away with it. Holy shit, Jesse. We are hallway royalty. You're like Megan Markle. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Markle. That's what I said. Megan Markle from Soups. Connie, Mommy, come. Okay. Does she, I think she intentionally mispronounces words. Who I don't know, but I just I'd love to see Maya Rudolph in the voice recording thingy doing some of these lines because it's just the idea is so damn funny to me. I want a tail. A, 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 a How'd you get an apple broke? Daddy bought it for me because he loves me. Lori, this is crazy. A toddler doesn't need an expensive high tech broke. Connie, relax. It's just credit cards. It's not real money. Ain't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How did you get an apple broke? I don't even understand how any kind of electronic anything works, much less banking. So it's imaginary, but it's real? Okay. Spoils a divorce, Nick. Maybe you should break your parents up. It really is so, so unfair, Nick. I mean, your mom should just buy you one of me. Wait, how do you know about my bitch mom? I know everything. I'm the Apple Brooch. Oh, wow. The ultimate.
ultimate symbol of fuckability. I must have you. Yes, Nick. I'm gonna make you... Well, if you're voiced by who I think you are... Uh, I wouldn't say you ha are, like, on the fuckability level as, say, Jensen Ackles, but you're kind of in the medium there. Jeff Goldblum would be, like, the date you... I gave it away. Shit. The sexiest little boy in all of Bridgeton. I'm gonna fuck that brooch about the first thing I do. OMG, you guys. Lady Pussy Squeak says I look absolutely immaculate at the ball last night. I wonder who she is. <laughs> Definitely not me. Uh, who cares about Lady Pussy Squeak? Everyone cares deeply. Wait, wait. Lady Pussy Squeak. Sure. That's the thing I question. Yet her identity remains very much unknown. Well, I care about books, women going to college, and wearing very high collars. Missy, get it together. Duke Major Hunk is eating custard. Oh, yeah, he's really going to town on that spoon. No, he's... Honestly, sounds about as exciting as the show Bridgerton. I've actually never seen Bridgerton. I might check it out just as, like, a dare to myself, because it sounds... If you like those kinds of shows, great. Uh, watch them to your leisure. But I grew up with so much of these PBS period pieces. P PBS esque period pieces. Like Masterpiece Theater, especially. Not that they were bad at all. They weren't. They were actually quite high-quality programming. But it's just... If you've seen one, you've seen a lot of them. You've seen them all, kind of. Going off to the bowl. Oh, that's so much dairy. Do you think he's going to get sick tonight? Oh, I don't know. But it looks like he spilled some on the table. Oh, yeah. Ate it, you nasty little termite. <gasps> oh, good God. Elijah didn't even have to touch you to send you all the way to Shondaland. Told you taking it slow could be hard. Damn right. So, Missy, who do you think Lady Pussy Squeak really is? It's it's totally low. No, 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 no. Keep wanking. We need to go back and investigate. All right. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, Dad. How you old now? Not good, Nikki. Your grandpa won't stop eating asparagus. Yeah, it's been stressful for all of us. I'm actually a little bit worried that my self-esteem is suffering. <gasps> Your self-esteem? Yeah, and Jessie got an apple brooch at school. Wait, so six? Okay, we're good. Cool, and she made me feel like, like, I don't have one? Oh, no, but no, you know what? Mom is right. I don't deserve it. I'm a bad boy. Nikki, bite your tongue. I'm gutter trash. I stink. P.U., you, you know? You stop that. You smell lovely. Now, here, take my credit card and go buy yourself. No. <laughs> oh, brooch. But, Dad, what about Mom? I mean, we'd have to keep this a secret from her as long as we live, right? Yes. I'll just do what I do with all my secrets. Whisper it into the open body cavity of one of my patients and then sew it right back up. There's a horror film, there's a horror story in there waiting to come out, isn't there? All right, Angel. I used to hear scratching, but now there's just a terrible... Sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I, I hate doing this, but I, I can't miss a moment of Marty. Because, oh, for God's sakes. What? I can't really watch the show with you being melodramatic. Fine. Don't distract me. You used to hear scratching. But now there's just a terrible odor. So whatever's under there must be dead. And you're sure you don't want to call a professional exterminator? Hey, you want the three bucks or not? But I don't know about this, Maury. It looks pretty scary under there. But if you're ever going to afford nice things, you need to degrade yourself with backbreaking labor. That's capitalism. Uh, okay, Dad. I'm not seeing anything. <laughs> God damn it, that's me. Except for I would... I would partially want to explore a space like that, but on the other hand, I know there's shit down there I wouldn't want to see. It does smell pretty bad. You're not getting paid unless you bring me no. a corpse. Oh, wait, wait a second. 
I see something. Yep, it's a dead possum. Yeah, reeks pretty bad. Must have been down here for a while. Damn it, is that me? Whoever wins is my true son. <laughs> God, Jesus Christ, Marty. You want to view it then? So, Jesus Christ. Worst father ever. <laughs>